door. Hugo, you ready to start? Yay! It's Debbie's Valley season two! Yay! Ah! Do, 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 do. <sighs> I am so, so sorry. Yeah, I know you are, Hugo. Ugh. Do you want to just do this another time? No. No. You know what they say. The show must go on. So we're just going to do this. Okay, if you're sure. Yeah. I'm sure. What were we, uh, what were we going to talk about today? Um, whoo! We saw a trailer! Oh, yep. That's right. We did. We saw... The new Godzilla 2, King of the Monsters trailer. Yeah! Whoa! It, whoa! You sound kind of excited about this. I am. I am really excited. You want to just kind of go first then? Since you're really in, into this right now? Oh, okay. Yeah. It was great. There's cities blowing up. And there's monsters everywhere. And everyone's on fire. And it's just great. It looks like it's going to be awesome. I am really excited about this one. You are too, right? Wait. Um, actually, I, uh, I didn't really like the trailer very much. What? Why not? I, I thought we were going to agree on something finally. That would be nice if we could. I, what's your problem with this? Well, I, Richard, what's wrong? Well, all right. Look, okay, I know this is a different take on Godzilla, all right? This is a different version. I understand that, but, like, in the old ones, you know, Godzilla was a protector of the Earth, right? Yeah. And if giant monsters came and attacked the Earth, Godzilla fought them. And if humans were messing up the Earth, Godzilla fought them. Yeah. Yeah, so... I mean, yeah, it wasn't until the fifth one when he was, like, a good guy, an Earth, a real Earth protector, but you could say in the old ones, when he was a monster attacking Tokyo and other Japanese cities, that he was just pissed about nuclear bombs, and he was punishing humans for them, even though it's wrong people to punish, but still, that's what was going on. Mm -hmm. And in this trailer, it seems like... It seems like the Titan, well, I guess they're Titans now. They were Mutos, massive unidentified terrestrial organisms. But I guess now those are just the bugs from the 2014 Godzilla. So anyway, other monsters are the Titans. And they're here to wipe out humans because humans are messing up the planet. And it's like the roles are reversed. Like, Godzilla's here to wipe out the Titans. The Titans are here to fix the Earth, so... Whose side is Godzilla on? Is he here to protect the Earth or protect people? Or what? what's happening? Who cares? It's giant monsters and blowing up cities. Why do you care about this? I know, I know, I know. And I know it's a different Godzilla anyway. Yeah, it's different. He didn't have to follow his old story. No, I know, but... I don't know, it just seems kind of weird. And of course, this is a two and a half minute trailer for a two, probably two and a half hour movie, so it's really not fair to judge it on that, and you know, I'll go see it, and we'll see, but. And then, like, even how it looks, it looks great! Mothra looks like a turtle. Well, yeah, a little bit. Like, I thought, Ga I thought it was Gamera at first, like we got Gamera in this now, a crossover, that's cool, but I guess it was Mothra? Yeah, and, and I know, we're never going to get guys in rubber suits smashing cardboard buildings 
in an American Godzilla movie. It's just not going to happen. I know that. It's never going to happen. I know that. So it's got to be computer generated. It's so CG looking. It looks like a video game cutscene, the whole movie. A little bit. And I just... I don't know. I could go with something a little more practical effect. And I, I guess, how are you going to do that in this day and age? I, I understand that. You think you're just nitpicking this. I, I, you know what? I am. It's usually my job. I I know I, it's kind of strange. Again, role reversals here, I guess. Well, I just really like monsters. I, I know you do. I know you do. I do too. And, you know, I was really excited for this movie to come out. And then I saw the trailer. And now I'm not really that excited anymore. Now I'm more excited for when the rights go back to Toho, the Japanese company, in 2021, and they can start working on their monster universe. They're gonna do, ooh, like the Marvel Cinematic Universe. No, not like the, and that's another thing, okay. And Marvel gets this credit for creating cinematic universes. Well, they did, no, Toho did, back in the 50s and 60s. They made Godzilla, and Godzilla 2, and Rodan, and Mothra, and Varen. And then they started doing crossover films. They borrowed King Kong, borrowed, bought King Kong from Universal, and did King Kong vs. Godzilla, and they did Mothra vs. Godzilla, and they introduced Ghidorah, which also had Rodan and Mothra and Godzilla in it, and then redid that with Astro Monster, except without Mothra. And then they made Abra, the sea monster. They made sucks. I kind of like it, though. It's It sucks. It's not the best Godzilla movie, but I like it. And then they made, you know, Son of Godzilla. That's awful. That is awful. That's a terrible movie. But then for the ninth one, they did what I guess now would be considered the Avengers 1 model. They brought all the monsters in. Well, except for King Kong. They didn't want to pay for him again. And Abra, because nobody cared about Abra. And they made a big giant monster mashup movie called Destroy All Monsters. And that was... That was the original cinematic universe. Or actually, I guess Universal probably really started even before that with, with monster movies, with Wolfman and Dracula and all that, and all the crossover films, Wolfman versus whoever. I don't, I'm honestly, I'm ignorant to those. I never really watched those. I did, they're great. Well, maybe this Halloween we'll watch some old black and white Universal horror movies. Well, we should, okay. But anyway, that's my rant, I guess. Yeah, that was that was a rant. You just you're just complaining to complain. I, we'll go see the movie together when it comes out, and maybe I'll feel a little better about it then. Okay, I'm gonna hold you to that. Okay. Well, that's my feeling on the Godzilla trailer. I'm not excited about it. I thought it looked kind of dumb. Well, we don't listen to him. The Godzilla trailer looked great, and the movie's gonna be great, and I can't wait, and I've got my Godzilla toys, and, and it's gonna be good, and I'm excited for it. Well, here you go. I'm glad you're excited for it. What was that? They, they don't know. They don't know what that is. Come on, let's, let's go take a look. Yeah, okay.